So yesterday, I sat in the washroom and there is a way when you're all alone, a reflection come. And I began to reflect on my journey with Jesus. And I noticed that some years back, I was just a religious zealot. I was involved in many activities of my faith, but it was towards a goal that God would grant me a desire of my heart. And I did everything. I was fasting, I was praying, but I wasn't living a holy life. Even though I was a born again believer, that was an aspect of my journey. Then now I have grown to know him where I've seen the dead come alive. I've seen unborn children that doctors were ready to evacuate because there was no heartbeat come alive and it has been birthed and it's living. I've seen depression leave people. I've seen sicknesses vanish. I have seen, you know, the prophetic word I play and coming alive. And I compare both. And I see if the past I was born again, yet that was a level I was struggling with sin. And this level, I am seeing God at play, God on the move, the impossibilities becoming possible. Then there is a higher dimension of God that I can't get stuck in this level. There are higher dimensions. And I began to think about it. And as I was thinking about this, this song came, open the eyes of my heart lord it means that our heart has an eye and when it's closed it lasts after worldly things but when the eyes of your heart is open you see god in his glory you see him lifted up where his power comes with his love to cause the cause of christ to be established there are different dimensions in god there are different dimensions i don't know where you are with your walk with him but I just want to entreat you that there are levels in God. Don't get stuck at the level of just salvation saved by grace and still wallowing in sin. No, don't get stuck in where you are seeing only manifestation. But there is a place where the Shekinah glory is constantly beaming and showing forth God's glory. I don't know, but I desire more of him. And I want you to desire it too. I want you to desire him. I don't know why I'm sharing this with you, but I pray it blesses someone.